Hello, and thanks for tuning into my channel. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, hey y'all. So today, guys, we are gonna be doing a what's in my bag. And we have the Coach Horse and Carriage Tote, which is the largest of the two. There are two sizes in this tote. And I have the bigger one. Of course, gotta go big or go home. Anywho, <laughs> let's get right to what's into this bag, okay? Um, I'm gonna open it up. There was one issue. I, I don't know if you guys can see it. I do need to take this tag off because I've worn this bag about four times and this tag is still on here. Can y'all see that? Those little black spots? That was there when I bought this bag. And I've had it for a couple weeks. Oh no, what is that? Oh well. Okay, anywho, I'll try to get that off. So let's get right to it. So in here, the first thing will be my cell phone because this is the case I'm carrying this week. As you guys can see, I got my watch face. All right, next we have this little bag I found at the Dollar Tree. And I decided to just put some little goodies in there because I always have like something to snack on in my bag. And because this is like a um, microfiber type suede, I don't know what type of material this would be. I didn't want to have any candy or chocolate in here and jeopardize ruin the inside of the bag. All right, um, car keys. Well, actually these are my house keys, but car keys are not on here. Next, this shouldn't be in here either, but I did just order this off Amazon not too long ago and I took it so that I can show somebody how good it worked because my hands stay cold and you know, we go to football games and stuff, football games for the school so we can have something to do on Friday nights if we get bored. So this is a hand warmer. Plus, it's also a charger. And I be forgetting it's a charger and I still be taking chargers. <laughs> Which is cool because when it is cold outside, I would want the juice in here strictly for keeping my hands warm. All right, so, passport holder. My best friend bought me this for my birthday in August. And I just keep it in here now because it's white, of course, and I always wanna make sure I know where it's at. So I just keep it in this bag. And this will be the home, this will be the bag it's housed in. Even when I'm not carrying this bag, I will probably keep this holder in the bag. It's really cute. And it even says passport right there. I don't know what's going on with this lighting. Okay, so we have that. Next, my car keys. I have a Chevy Traverse and you know, we still got old school, what you call this? I don't know what year they start giving people a newer looking remote control, but I don't have one. Then I have my eyeglasses because I need them for nighttime. As you can see, oh, I need to clean these off. They're cute. All right, and then I have my fan, of course, because listen, where I work, the city controls the air and the heat. And when it was hot outside, for coming from being cold, they had the heat on. And I work in a school, uh, so we had to be hot. So, of course, I got my fan. Just in case they try to pull that sun again and have some heat on, burning us up in the 80 degree weather. Next, I just have my, um, my little round coin pouch from Coach. I actually have two coin pouches from them. One is glitter, I love it. Then I have my large corner zip pouch and in this pouch ladies and gents if you're watching gents it's just some feminine products I use L brand um, organic products and then I just have some flushable wipes some panty liners uh, a deodorant wipe because I told y'all they had the heat on when the heat was on in real life like God provided heat but they gave us more heat and it was hot my boobs were sweating so I was like, Lord, this ain't gonna work. So of course, you know, I had to put my secret wipes in here. So whenever my boobs start sweating, I can go ahead and wipe them boys down. <laughs> All right, next, I just have my notebook. And I found this insert from Five Below. I always get lucky and find inserts from Five Below that will fit the coach notebook cover. So I take theirs out and I just uh, put this in. And then it even comes with stickers in the back. These are the stickers this one came with. This is my one from last year. I just stuck it in there. So it's really cute. Um, this one is actually different from last year's. This calendar setup, but it's still functional. So that is that. All right, and then I have 
some page markers because when I'm doing my lesson plans, I like to mark my pages for the next lesson so that I know where I'm at. I go right to it and it is what it is. I even give them to my kids. So like if we're going to be reading this particular story, they can page mark the story we're on. Next, I just have my coach pencil case. And as you can see, this mug is loaded. I just have my toe markers, my toe pens. You know, I love stitch. So I don't know if y'all can see that, but it's just um, Lilo and Stitch. Wait, no, this is just, yeah, Lilo's on there. Toe pencils. This is a pen I found. Where'd I buy this at? I think I bought this from Hobby Lobby. And then another Lilo. And then a pencil from Pentel. And that's about it in there. And an Enjoy Paper Made pen. Oh, and um, some little clips. I didn't realize how close I was to this camera. Then I have the lotion my man hates. I mean, it don't smell bad to me, but it's not the best smell in the world either. I've had some Dove that smell way better and some Mary Kay, not Mary Kay, Avon that is more soothing and longer lasting than that Chanel. And this little tube was like $50. I do want the black one though. Maybe just because I like the black and pink writing on it. I don't know. I'm weird like that. Next, I have my um, cash envelopes. And as you can see, I'm broke. <laughs> I don't need gas. I got gas. I have my ones in there, my dog food, my fives, some grub. This one I was giving out that PVT, so I just keep them in there so I don't lose them. All right, next I have the wallet to go with the purse my son bought me, which is my coach um, Marley Tote. I think it's called a Marley Tote. I don't know guys, if you remember watching that unboxing, this had a stain on it. I did wipe it with a water wipe and it came right on out. I don't have, mm, excuse me, I don't have the wristlet that goes with it though. And I just have some cards, you know, nothing major. It's big, I don't have it stuffed like normal. I've been switching so many bags lately that I just put the necessities in there. How that song goes, the bare necessities. Anywho. <laughs> Oh, one of my students gave me this as a gift. I give them gifts every Friday just because, right? And she gave me this, which is so cute. And then, guys, this is on here in case I just want to take this pouch. I can just extend it and have a longer bag if I don't want to carry this. So I just leave it hanging on there, seeing that it's in my purse and no one really sees it anyway. And I got this off Amazon. And in it, I just have a portable, some more earbuds, my Lilo and Stitch. This is only on my work thing. And I just found my gun lock key, y'all. I thought I lost it. Oh my God, I thought I had lost this key. But it was, where was it? It was in the bottom of one of my bags. It came off the hook on my, um, Actually, it was in the bottom of my Never Fool, which is how is it in there? I don't know. That means it had to be in there for a while because I ain't wore that bag in a while. So when I was doing something with that Never Fool, I saw it. So I just put it on here so I can remember to put it on my keys. And this is just a um, hand sanitizer holder and a little lip gloss holder. I ordered this from a seller off Macari. I thought that was so cute because y'all know it's Stitchy Poo so cute anywho um that's my favorite disney thing and then i have some lysol um some mary Kay. this is black opium uh body oil some chanel number 804 this is so pretty on my lips for every day y'all i love it i didn't think it was gonna go with me but it does and this is my black open I was wearing. So I had my oil and my perfume. Because. Whew. Anywho. What else we got in there? Oh. Another paper clip. Somewhere. I know I saw it. Another paper clip. And this is my uh, room key for my classroom. And of course I got Stitch. Stitch Meister. 
All right, and just on here, I just have my little taser because of course I can't take a gun to school or on school property. So, you know, I don't get to, I don't even put my gun in the car when I'm going to work. Sad, but I don't. All right, and then this pocket, this is just some uh, over-the-counter medicine and some alcohol wipes. I thought I had some band-aids in here. I guess my kids took them all out. All right, so that is that. And I got this when I went to Memphis in, um, when did I go to Memphis? In July, I think, for a Memphis meetup with some family members whom we had never met before. And it turned out to be a really good time. My AirPods, a pill case. These are prescription pills in here. And, uh, um, what do you call this? A, a program for my son's orchestra program. <laughs> He plays the violin. And then this is not a pocket, but I be stuffing stuff back here, y'all. Like, it's a real pocket. Why? I don't know. And in there, I'm going to show you what that is in a minute. This is a little pouch I got from the Dollar Tree. I have so many of these pouches. I got them in black, green, pink, yellow, and orange, I think. And as you can see, they just house my stickers. So whenever I want to stick anything in my planner, I can. Gotta have some kind of stickers. Right, probably gonna take these AirPods out and charge them. So that is that. Let's put that key in this zipper, which I'm gonna switch purses. So that key, I need to put it on here because um, I normally have this on a lanyard and it has my key on it. And then I just carry my lanyard around my neck because if you lock the door of your class, you have to try to hunt down the the janitor, shall I say, the custodian, to find him so he can let you in your classroom. Meanwhile, your class is just outside, impatient, wondering when y'all gonna get in the classroom. So guys, that is it. That is all on what's in my bag. This bag actually holds a lot. I love it. Um, it's not an everyday bag for me. It won't be, for one, look at the inside, and also it's white. <laughs> I do wear it though, because I didn't get it until the latter part of the summer early fall maybe beginning of fall i don't know if it was still summer or fall when i got this bag but i've had it for a while i just don't wear it let me take this off all right um here's my stuff i'm gonna leave this out because i do need to check my lesson plans because i've been on break this week and i have a teacher's meeting on monday but this week went by so fast and i said i was gonna do the planning for the week after this week I ain't looked at them lesson plans, y'all. So today is Thursday. Maybe I need to because tomorrow will be Friday. And then I told Babe we don't spend the whole weekend together just chilling because he's been out of town for work for the week. Even though he came home early today. Yay. But, you know. All right, guys. That is it. That is all on what's in my bag. I hope you guys enjoyed being nosy because I enjoy being nosy seeing what's in y'all purses, too. Because some of y'all be putting me on on some stuff I don't be knowing about. I be like, oh, I need that. Which I don't need none. I be wanting it. So it's the difference between want and need. And when I be seeing stuff in y'all bags, and I be like, oh, yeah, I want that. <laughs> Let me go order that right now. So, guys, it's still fastens. And this clip is just as strong. What should I say? This magnet is just as strong as the one on the, um, on the city tote. Y'all see that? Or is it just me? Some kind of a plastic. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. All right, that is it. That is all. This is what it looks like stuffed. Because y'all know my bags be stuffed with everything and the kitchen sink. Y'all, shout out to my Dollar Tree nails. I show saw these at the Dollar Tree. I was like, hmm, okay, let me get them. They look like they're a dollar, but who cares? I'm going to polish over them, though, <laughs> because I did want some short nails for next week. So I'm just gonna polish over them with my Ferrari Red Polish. I was eating pizza earlier. Well, not even earlier, just like right before I filmed this video. I got a little pizza in there. But I'm gonna polish them over with some Ferrari Red Gel Polish, and it's gonna be my manicure for the week. $2, I spent $2, and I already had the polish. So here it is, I'm gonna have me a whole little manicure for $2. Anywho, y'all, thank y'all so much for watching because <laughs> you know I can talk. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and conclude this video. Don't forget to hit that like button if you liked what you saw. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye.